In this video, you'll learn how to create an ASR job listing in NHS Jobs. You must be a user of NHS Jobs and ASR to follow the steps in this video. Before you begin, you need a cost centre and an active ASR position. To start, sign in to your organisation's account. On your employer dashboard, select the Create a Job Listing button. To create the listing from a position in ASR, select Yes and select the Continue button. Next, you'll find the cost centre using the full or partial code as it is in ASR. Enter the cost centre into the box and select the Find Cost Centre button. From the search results, select the correct cost centre and select Continue. If you can't see the cost centre you need, select the Search for the Cost Centre Again link. Now you'll find the position using the full or partial job title as it is in ESR. Enter the job title into the box and select the Find Position button. To confirm if this is the correct position, select Yes or No and select the Save and Continue button. If the job title is not right, you can change it later in NHS Jobs. To change the job title, select Yes or No and select Continue. The default job title is from ASR and this is what's visible on the job advert. In this example, you're changing the job title. Read the information on the page, select Yes or No and select Continue. On the Change Job Title page, enter the new job title into the box and select Save and Continue. To change the reference number, select Yes or No and select Continue. The default reference number is from NHS Jobs. In this example, you're changing the reference number. Enter the new reference number into the box and select Save and Continue. The final step is to check and save the details. Select the change link to make any changes. Once complete, select Save and Continue. You've completed the ESR position section for the job listing. You can select the ESR position link to check this information. You must now complete all remaining sections to publish it.